The spirit urgently passes a hand across the spines, whispering each tome's title as she comes across it. No, no, it isn't here. This is impossible. You, my brother, help me find it. There is little time. Play along? Say you can help... Uh, the spirit is meaningless... Oh, I can't see myself. Play along and point to the shelf. There's a copy of Spirits and Spectres just right there. This is no time for pranks, my friend. The doctor's arrogance may end us all. He has released a dark presence upon us. It must never sing the taming. The hymnals must be destroyed. Ooh, okay. And yet, I see no sign one was ever here. You must help me look. Her hands fan furiously across the tomes like a pianist's upon the keys. Quiz her about the dark presence. What is it exactly? A malignant more rotten than any I've known, brother. It should have been confined to the vault. I'd have offered myself up for the sacrifice had I known the doctor's intentions. Now be silent. Your questions vex me, and I have no time for idle chatter. Find the others, and gather near the flaming guardians. Should the hymn be sung, the vaults can be opened. We are not safe. Okay, I guess they've already been opened. She hushes you with an index finger held to your lips, and continues her search. Be on your way. Is that, is that it? Okay. I got to ask one thing. I bet all those, I bet all those different uh, conversation options would have led to the same thing, though. Otherwise, it'd be incredibly annoying if I missed the one chance to ask the really important questions. Opening the book, you read the description of items to exercise as a child. It seems the priests were quickly overwhelmed by the demons within. They were never able to find even an echo of the child's soul. Silent as the grave. Oh, nice. Someone stashed a longbow behind a row of books. That's a neat trick. 51 to 63 plus earth damage. Set slowed, set blinded. That's quite good. I'm going to send that to Beast because um, he might occasionally find himself in need of a weapon that uh, doesn't do water damage. Franny Hewitt's book on humans makes for interesting reading. By acknowledging humans' obvious physical limitations, he considers that race to be the most intelligent, intellectual, Ingenious, versatile, resourceful, audacious, and adventurous of all the peoples. While many of his claims may be deemed correct, it must be noted that Hubert himself is a human. The trait overconfident should perhaps be added to the list. Does it sell? Ah, I'll pick it up. What's in there? Nothing. Okay, we just need to go around the inside of this still. The Archivist's Journal. The dark present encroaches. Let this journal serve then as a monument to truth, a rare treasure in a world built on lies. Excuse me a second. Ah, dry throat. To whomever reads this, please know, we only intended to protect, never harm. No priest I know would see the innocent suffer. Blood Moon's island's very purpose was to keep Rivalon safe, to exercise and cleanse, to relieve demon-infested souls wherever we might find them. Not every victim is so easily purified. These are the unlucky ones, destined to writhe eternally. Vessels for demons too stubborn to return to the plane they call home. Elanessa was one such vessel. Deva brought the elf sorcerer here. She was limp, glass-eyed, silent. We all felt the presence when we drew near. We knew such darkness could never be cast out. She would be banished to the vaults along with a priest unlucky enough to shackle her. But it was never to be. Deva had tired of seeing brothers and sisters sacrificed. He, I thought that was going to be a female name. We'll call him Dave. He performed the exorcism on Elanessa himself. In spite of our protest, in spite of our prayers, and so the shadow was released. Hey, Stefan, nice to see you. I have indeed been enjoying this game. It's really good. It's a really good game. The first game was as well. This is excellent. This one almost feels overwhelming with the amount of stuff to do, but it's a, it's a great game. And so the shadow was released. Elanessa did not survive the exorcism, but I take some comfort in knowing an ancestor tree will grow where she fell. As for Dave, I do not know his fate. I rushed to the archive, knowing the presence must never be allowed to sing the hymn, and enter the vaults. Yet I found but one. Where the rest may be, I can't be certain, so now I wait. The shadow will soon engulf me. Whatever Blood Moon Island might become, know what it once was, a temple of hope and healing. I pray this is how you remember us. Well, that's a pretty nice... Little, little journal. 
Tales of the Seven Gods. Anything in there, by the way? Stardust. That sounds very important. How you doing anyway, Stefan? Nice to see you again. Is that a pile of books? It is indeed. And Frost Scroll. I'll take that. Oh my god, there's so much stuff. I think we have to go around the other side for that. I'll have that. I'll, I'm having that book. It looks, it looks expensive. We're having that picture. <laughs> oh, did I loot this, by the way? No, I didn't. Did I check the piles of books on this side? No, I didn't. I haven't been to this side yet. That might be why. Another medical report. This was the most difficult case indeed. The demon who had attached itself to this particular soul fed on pain. There was no amount of suffering the individual could endure that did not cause the demon the greatest joy. In the end, it was safer and more humane to commit both the soul and the demon to the vaults. But I'm guessing something has uh, let them out. Something? Or, oh, I need to go around the other side and loot all those as well. There is so much stuff to pick up in this. Is that a little book there I can go and steal? Nope. Okay. What about this side? Yeah. Two. Forty-five. Nice. Right, let's go and check these out. What was that flickering and flashing up there? Oh, it's a chest. Oh my god, Cradles and Silly Book of Blanks. I'm just picking up everything now in case anything is needed. T is for Troll. The term Troll Behaviour refers to the way trolls live their lives from killing and feeding to roaring and courtship rituals. Once you've begun to, to identify the trolls in your local meadows and caves, your next step is to find out how they behave. Luckily this book is here to help. All trolls make formidable bows, not just due to their state, but due to their talents for health regeneration. I think I've read this. Is this just the one... Virulent trolls use poison freely. Blazebone trolls are eternally thirsty. Amphibious trolls can breathe under water. Poisoning. Okay. Behavioral notes. Death fog kills most living things, but trolls may actually develop immunity with mild prolonged exposure. I'm having that. A troll book. Just what we wanted. Oh, God. So much stuff. To the lumberjack magicians. Nope, no new recipe. The code of wizardry. Nope, nothing new there either. Uh, we'll have that, so we can sell it. Take a look down here. Why can we can we not walk down this? Right, there's nothing supposed to be picked up down there. Then. Where do we come through? We came from there. I think we've picked up everything going through here. We need to figure out a way of actually. Is that just a... It is just a slide the thing across the job. Any new ghosties to, to speak to? An unusual blade. Anything over here first? The transparent artifact glimmers of its own accord as if conducting light from another world, another plane of living. As your hand nears it, it shivers and speaks. You listen closely, but while you think you've heard similar utterances in the past, you cannot make sense of its words. Examine the object closely. It's a crystal blade, seemingly separated from its hilt. It's clearly of a kind with the object you recovered from the Surrey tomb. Oh, yes, we do still have that with us. No, we don't. We handed that over to, um, Chap of the Strange and Tarquin. That was it. Try speaking with it. The object repeats its indecipherable twaddle. You can glean no more from it. Nick it. Not just another oddity, it would seem. It spoke to me. Quite just an everyday currents in this world trees speak to you rats speak to you why not swords as well and broken swords too right so this looks like it's going to clearly blow up in my face i can feel my source powers draining at the merest touch 
Tenebrium is truly a material of the void. Huh. Well, if we're going to lose our source from doing it, let's try blessing it. And then pick the lock. It's unlocked. I can feel my source powers draining at the merest touch. Yeah, I can live with that. Oh, nice. Of the void. That one has, I'm guessing that's limited uses, or it requires, can be used in combat. Glowing runes mark this pyramid as an item for out of the ordinary. Using it will teleport the wheel to the location of a near identical pyramid. I'm going to send that to um, Ifen, I think. My lucky day. You can a have a third pyramid. The other two, however, oh, what do they look like? Oh, God, I hate trying to find these things. Magical? No. What were the other? Oh, there's, there's one. That's the use in combat, then, because I've used these loads and they haven't actually um, been reduced, which is excellent. Nice, that's good news. Same as the first two I found, just a different colour, yellow and blue. It did show me some other ones, like when you try to use one. It shows you the other ones, although... We can't use that one. Because we don't know where it is. Obviously. That was, uh, that was worth the source points, I think, there. Uh, I think we're probably done in here. They will come in useful at some point later on, I'm sure. Let's get out then. We've been through the archive. We need to we need to find the vault. And we need to find some more corpses to consume as well. So come out there and let's have a look on the map. This is the ancestor tree. We haven't searched down this way. The Ancient Forge. That's where I think I was going, but I didn't actually locate it. Let's just head south from here. If I can find the direction on the map. Oh, there's a source vat here. I haven't actually found a source vat here. Oh, you mean the one in the... Um, oh, in the... Uh, I can't remember what you call it now. The Meister's House. Right, we have found something of interest here. And these things... Uh, let me save this. Let me get some high ground here first. Oh, it's a fight. Okay, that thing saw me a mile away. Who are we on? We're on Ifen first. Let me just check what some resistances are here. Crap. Water? That's not good. Not for him. Is that the thing that's going to go next? No, it's the one over there that's going to go next. I might just teleport that across the other side of the... Um... <laughs> yeah, that's a good move. I'm going to teleport him out of the way. And let's drop him right... I'm going to drop him on that thing. Splat. Should I move out the way for my next trick? No, I'm not. I'm going to summon something. What have we got? Have we got any surfaces around? Not yet. I said that. These, apart from him, they don't have a lot of physical armor, so let's summon up... An ally to soak up some damage. Mm, let's just move and hide out in the cover so he doesn't get killed in the first turn. Yeah, that would be good use for those teleporters just to nip straight back to the, the source place instantly. Good idea. Is 
says path's interrupted to him. That, I don't think that's going to hit, is it, if I aim at that? Uh, is there a good... Mm, I think I should probably stay where I am. I shoot him in the face. That was a seriously good hit. And should we save some points? Save two points for next turn. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I don't like the positioning of everything there. Hey, Morel, Nice to see you back. What was that? An explosion. A blood sucker. Did it just heal itself up? Living on the edge. It's got death resist. It's blowing up my loot here. <laughs> uh, so what we want... They are so nicely lined up. Are they highly resistant to fire? They are a bit. That thing isn't. All right, let me move to there. So I might have a chance of a decent shot at this. No, it's too awkward a sodding angle to shoot at. Impalement. Epidemic of fire. Will it even hit him? I'm going to use that because... Yes! Yes, that's what we wanted. I've been wanting to play with that for ages. Oh, that was nice. I should probably advance to combat and keep them out of the way of coming in too close. Or I could drop right in the middle of them and cause some utter chaos. Should we do that? Yeah, that's, no, I won't be able to get any big AOEs on them then, will I? Oh, bollocks to it, let's do it. Black Ring. Was it the death fog that got them or something else? This is not the time for musing thoughts. Nice hit. He really wanted to go after Beast there. It's my go again. Hmm, is any... I suppose I can do this for a double attack. Oh, I didn't want to land there. Of all the places. It would have much suited me much better to land in front of that other thing. Right, he's crippled, which is nice. Beast could kind of do with getting out of there, I think. Who are we on? Not too much water immunity. How about we... Um, curse. Charm him. And let's power up my demon as well with a bit of power infusion. I'll yield to Where's the demon? When does he get to go, actually? We can possibly get a hit on there. Well, we got the hit. Shame we didn't kill him. Left him on seven poxy hit points. What's down there worth shooting in the face? Ah, let's just... Well, he's going to die from the fire anyway. He doesn't get to go for a while. Let's put a shot into that thing then, I, I guess. Is he charmed? Which one was charmed? Has that worn off already? Yes, it, it has. 
That guy is laying into me. Fireball. Ah, it's such a bad angle, this. Shooting downhill doesn't work. Unless I want to try and shoot those two, which I, I probably shouldn't. Oh, hang on. What's the resistances before I, I do anything? A little bit to fire. But, I mean, I, I do an insane amount of fire damage, so let's do a nice big fire whip. Ching! And is there anything I can do to him? Because he's going to get to go real soon, and I'm hoping he's going to take the damage at the start of his turn, and that'll be the end of that. Decaying. Are you out of... Oh, can I do a... No, I can't pull source out of these things, sadly. Save the point. Maybe out one of these I can. The old physical armor has run out pretty damn quick. Right, and kill one of those at least. Did that do damage to me? Because I saw some odd numbers go up over my head then that I wasn't expecting. It didn't look like healing. There, again, as well. What was that? Yeah, I think that did damage. Did those things blow up when they died, those damn dogs? I think they did. Curses. Let's battering ram my way to that. Knock them both down. Get the kill there. Get two extra points. And I can't go up there and kill him, sadly. Is there no way of jumping him? I can do a battle stomp. Well, that's a nice critical hit, actually. A lot better than I was expecting. Right, move to there. Make sure I can see him. And let's magic him up. Mosquito Swarm. Yeah, that's healing. That's nice. I'll take that. Uh, what can I do? What's their stats? Air damage would work. But I get the resi I get the cheap... Yeah, I've got, I've got infect him. <laughs> nice bit of healing there. Cartag, nice to see you. I'm good, thanks. I'm good. By the way, folks, I, I know a few people are joining late. Um, I was late back from Leeds today. I'm going to be at Leeds for a few more days this week. I'm there tomorrow, so the stream tomorrow will be uh, late starting. It's probably going to start between 5 and 6 p.m. when I get back. Just to, just to give you a heads up. So they're dead on the floor. This is the only thing left now. Right, let's do a tactical retreat. I just need to make sure I can actually hit this thing. Let's pin him down. Well, cripple him anyway. That was a seriously good hit. A madness spell. Brutal, again. Entirely brutal. Is that it? No, we've got Beast to deal with. Can I not clear his mind? It says it clears mad. Clear-minded. We're good? We're good. Right, gather up. Gather up. There's something to check out up here. You got your family visiting? Oh, okay. Well, don't waste time here. Go and, uh, go and have fun with the family. Family moments are precious and hard to come by, I find, in, with modern life. We're good. Everything's good. Quick save. Catch you next time, Gartag. Ooh. 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 20% crit chance. Cleave damage. 67 to 77 physical. I think I would rather take that. And it's got a rune slot. Um, plus one two-handed doesn't make up for the plus three strength, but the 20% crit chance and the extra damage might. 
This one I've got the 61 to 73, including the water damage. So that's technically better. And I can ruin it. Okay. Uh, let's let's get this equipped straight away. There's some really nice stuff that we've got going on here. That's a poison sword in case I ever need it. And that's got a small thunder rune. Let's just take that rune out. Extract. Just got to keep on top of my runes because otherwise I'll end up selling them. And we don't want to do that. Let's stick a rune in this. What have I got? Have I got the big? Uh, I've got that one. 13% damage is physical damage. So it's currently doing 67 to 77. That's going in. And now it does 76 to 87. That is stacking nicely. That is a brutal hit. Oh, it's going to be good fun. Let's hit something with a big axe. Yeah, we've got that to go down, which is clearly something very important. Uh, some more loot to achieve here, and maybe some source to extract as well. Letter pulses as if possessing a heartbeat and glows with pale light. Children of the God King, the priests are in disarray and the tree is soon to give up its secrets. It is time to descend upon Blood Moon Island. The demons would bar the way with death fog, but I dare say the unliving among you should have no trouble passing, nor should those with a gift for surviving such toxins. Uh, ghost, your desire and your duty. The missive is signed with a single letter, S. Who is this? This S of which they speak. Have we met anyone? That would fit that? Hey, Tiger Pals, thank you for the drink. Cheers. I was going to have a beer tonight, actually. I've got a beer in the... It's, I've got a... This blonde ale that's been in the fridge for months. I got it when we had the heat wave in the UK. I thought I'm going to save that for another hot day when we can have a barbecue or something. And guess what? There's been no other hot days. Our summer has just, just gone. It's been rubbish. A magical headdress. Scoundrel and summoning. Well, summoning's always nice. Let me just check on their gear. Summoning is always good. Oh, that's a crap ton of extra armor look. It gets the summoning up. What's Fane got on? Because Fane doesn't often get an upgrade here. Huntsman and Hydra Sophist. Well, the thing is, the stats on Iffens are actually useful because he uses both those spells to good effect. It's, it's low level, but I'm tempted tempted to put him on there and then maybe see that is an upgrade this way as well and he'd still get the all I'd lose was the Aerith Village which I don't use a huge amount but I do use the water a lot so a bit of yeah go on then we'll do a bit of swapping around trouble is those characters look so similar in combat that's where I end up messing up and um, thinking I'm on the wrong one and using some ability that I shouldn't be. Let's just cast that. There's so no spirits around here. Then let's start eating all the dead. Wait, what? Oh, he's, he's over here. I lost sight of him then. Can I do that one, please? Well, let me get that. Can I do this one? Come on, can I see this body here? We seem a little bit sourceless at the moment. Should be plenty of bodies over here, though. It's It, it won't let me select this guy for some reason. There, okay. It's because he's a tall model and you have to select where his feet are. Awkward. If and summoning, it's not quite at 10 yet. It's getting there. With all his gear on and stuff, it is getting there, but it's not quite there. So I'm looking forward to seeing what I get when it gets to 10. But that's that's his goal. So where we're aiming for next. I would appreciate a faster way of sucking this source up if there is one. It's like in the old game, having to heal up after a fight was the thing that took forever. 
And uh, this isn't too bad. Oh, the healing's a lot better because you just rest, but it's like this is now the uh, the thing that the healing is, is replaced. It's spending ages sucking source out of things to get all your powers back. I'm just going to go and take a look down here. We've got... Oh, there is one down here. I love them silver bars. Thank you very much. 